Okay, I'm going to make a video here about my DG20 digital guitar. I'm doing this for a, a, a fellow YouTuber, uh, Keytar Chris. He lives in Vegas and he loves keytars. Who doesn't love a keytar? I don't have one. I was going to buy one. I didn't. I bought a G20 digital guitar. So, Chris, if you watch my video, this is it. This is my DG20. This thing's a beast. It's heavy. It's got an amplifier. It's got a speaker on it. If you look at it down there, you can see underneath that platform there on the back end, that circle, like, kind of right in there, there's a speaker, and it's got an amp. It's, it's pretty loud. I'm running it on, I gotta run it on batteries, because the, the thing doesn't work, so I'm gonna weigh it. Let's see what it weighs. Oh, did it, my, no, there we go. So it weighs... 8.6 pounds. Okay. There, what's that? 73 degrees Fahrenheit? Why is it giving me the temperature? Now, oh, okay. I could switch it to kilos, but I didn't. Now, I, I did a video earlier on this thing, and this thing's cool. What I did, uh, this is one of the special, this is personal video for Keytar Chris. So what I did was to make it look cool, and there's this reflector tape, and you can buy it at fishing stores. And it's for, you get them in sheets. See, there's several sheets here. I had to cut them, put them on. And so it reflects in rainbow. Yeah, rainbow, and it's black. So it's a black reflector that reflects in rainbow. Isn't that cool? That's cool. So anyways, I didn't put it on the back. I put some on the sides. There, there. But then up here I didn't, I don't know if I ran out, and I didn't put any on the back, because nobody's going to see it on the back. I mean, they might, you never know. So that, that's that. So, um, and then, like, if I turn it on, let's see here. So it's got its little sounds. I think I did another video like this, but I'm going to, because it's MIDI. So it's got like all these different sounds on it. I think I, I did this already in a video, but that's okay. It tones, it's got the tones, and it's got rhythms. So we can go like this. And you got a little button here where you can. And it got a separate volume for the rhythm. Okay. And for the guitar itself. So I can like I can turn off the drums. drum pads here, which is kind of cool, and it's got a filling, and it's cheesy, it's 80s, you know how we love that 80s shit, back when we were young men, strapping young, hard-working fools, and yes, I do have gas, gear acquisition syndrome. Hey, who doesn't? That's why I know how to play guitar, but I got that one, and I got this one, and my digital, and then I got all this equipment, and I got my pedal there, and I got all my keyboards, and ooh, harmonicas, and music is fun. Sometimes when you're down and out and not feeling like yourself, just go out and buy a new keyboard, and don't regret it. Never regret it. Um, actually, with nobody, you got to promise you guys don't say anything about this, because my wife doesn't watch my videos. What I did was, I got my bon, I got my bongos, or congos, those are congos, and then, then down here I got my bongos, and I bought my violin, you can see it's hiding there so my wife doesn't see it, it's an electric violin, <laughs> uh, it's really hard to play, like violins, I didn't know they were that hard, like, I can't get my fingers around, you know, playing it, like you're trying to reach around, you're holding it like this, and you're spazzing out and stuff, and it's like, like heavens to Murgatroyd, so let me, let me, um, well, that's it. I guess, I guess that's my video, and I wanted, uh, especially Keytar Chris, to see that to see that he's not the only one with gas. We all have gas. Uh, if you don't have gas, what good is a musician who doesn't have gas? Beard's looking pretty good. You have to dye pink again. I kind of like that. I'm gonna post this. Have a good one, gentlemen. And hey, Keytar, have fun over there in uh, Vegas. Hoo hoo.